Hi everyone, I'm Diane with Mimi's Life and I have a Timu haul today. Surprise, surprise. Um, I have a sponsored uh, Timu haul but they keep giving me like um, $30 uh, seating money. So I just got like a couple of sweaters and a couple of bracelets. And you are probably going to say, why do you keep ordering all those sweaters? But that's how I do. Like, I find something that I really like, and then I just go nuts on it. And then after a while, I'm thinking, why did I do that? But anyway, I have several sweaters to show y'all. Um, they're like uh, spring sweaters, you know, they're not heavy, they're those real thin ones, the one that I had a problem with and I got the place on it, you know. So, I'm just going to tell you a little bit about Timu. I know this is really, um, I don't know who don't know about Timu. So, um, it's an online shopping app and they have everything in the world that you're ever going to want. Um, they have kids, men's, women's, dogs, kitchen, uh, car, you name it, and Timu probably has it. So, at a really, really affordable rate. And, um, they have free shipping, um, uh, free return, 90 day free return, and, uh, I love it. I love them. And I'm addicted to it. So I think, um, as a lot of people are. But, um, anyway, I'm going to show you what I got on my, um, sponsored. And then I'll show you what I got through mine. I'm not going to do two videos on it. I hope they don't mind. I'm just going to go ahead and show you what I got on my sponsored. And then I'll just go in to show you what I got on my own so and I'll try these sweaters on so it, but I didn't write down the prices on them they want me to tell the prices but I didn't write the prices down they they run like $12.99 or something like that and they can go all the way up to like I think 17 if they're like plus size so this is the first one that I got it's those really paper thin, see how thin it is? Paper thin sweaters. And um, I have washed all of these. I've washed all of these. So, and they wash real good. I mean, you can't even tell that I washed it. So, it's, it's super, super thin. And they feel nice on. They're light. They're not heavy. Um, here in Texas, really in the springtime you can't even wear these because it's like okay we're what today is um march the 4th this weekend we hit 86 degrees already so you know we worked i worked in the yard all weekend but anyway i'll get to all that but anyway this is one of them that i got this pattern right here purse down off the bed. And this is the next one I got. This pattern. Oh, that's backwards, but you can't tell. So, and they're so thin I can actually see my ring light through it. So that's, that's the other the other pattern that I got and I got two bracelets that I thought um, would match them pretty good I got this one which it's what is four bracelets it's got the little a little uh, hard on there. I don't know if that says anything or not. I can't see it. So, I got those. I thought that would match that red one really good. Maybe not. It might be a little bit too too bright. It'd be fine. 
how is everybody? I had a busy weekend. And then I got this color. I really like these a whole lot. Those are so pretty. Aren't those pretty? This is a little, a little shell. Those are cute, cute, cute. Yeah, I like those. So that's what um, they sponsored me with, with those four things. They gave me $30. Really what I should do is just get on the jury um, deal and they give you a campaign. I picked like a winner something campaign. I can't remember the exact name of it. And I picked out two sweaters and two bracelets to match. So you always have to go by kind of, they give you like a certain campaigns to pick out of and they give you items to choose but there is another box up at the top where you can um, type in like your own things kind of relate to the what they want you to, to pick and pick your own. So that's kind of what I did instead of picking what, you know, they suggested. So I got those four things. So I'm going to go ahead and get into my haul, the one that I picked out for myself. And I picked out more sweaters. So... And what am I going to do with them? I don't know. Probably fold them up and put them in a tote till next year. I know. Silly, right? Well, this is um, one of my shirts that I got. Um, this is an extra large, too. So I really could have did a, a, a double X in this because they're made really small. I'll show you. It's got the teacups on it the little bird it's really really cute it's really soft really soft and this is not like an iron-on it's the actual you know actual shirt shirt so and I got um, these earrings if y'all can see what they look like I thought that that would match this shirt really well so that's what I have on today. I have on some white uh, Timu tennis shoes. My blue jeans are from the thrift store today. And my bracelet is from Timu. I worked in the yard this weekend and I am all banged up. Look at that. That's what I do though. I mean, I can just barely hit anything because I have an iron deficiency and vitamin D and all that stuff. I'm supposed to take all those vitamins. And so I try to. I try to take like a multivitamin a day to keep, you know, me from being so whatever. So let's get on into showing you the rest of my stuff. Um, here's another one that I got. Another t-shirt that I got. The Dragonfly. I thought that was real pretty. These are so light and so thin. They're going to be perfect. As long as they're not real like polyester, polyester feeling. Because sometimes that makes me hot. I don't know about y'all, but that real polyester stuff, make me. it makes me hot. You know, it's not like cotton. But anyway... Got that one. And here's the next sweater that I got. It's the black with the horse on it. I like these sweaters a whole lot. Y'all are probably thinking, yeah, we know you do. You got enough of them. So, got that one. This one's really cute. It's got the bear on the front of it, and I got a bunch of earrings that'll look really cute with this, and it's got the three colors. I just don't have no room in my closet. I've got to quit buying clothes. And then I got this one. I like this one a whole lot, too. This one's super thin. Like, I might even get a be able to get away with wearing this on a warm day so 
I really like that one. I gave those, um, you know, those those jeans that I hauled a while back that had the horse on the pocket. I gave them to Sadie. They look so cute on her, and she loves them. Those are her favorite jeans now. So that was a win-win. She she loved them. I'm gonna get a drink, guys. So I'll get into the other stuff that I got. Do y'all have a do y'all have a routine that y'all do every single day? I do. Well, not really on the weekends, but this weekend I told y'all I had a real busy weekend. Well, I was gonna get all of my um all of my giveaway stuff together. I went and got the boxes, got everything that I needed to pack this stuff up. Well, it was Tara's birthday, which is the youngest of the three girls. My old, my oldest son's three girls. She's the baby of them. Well, she turned 12. So, this Saturday was her birthday. So, that's what I did this weekend. I got ready for her birthday, and we had her birthday party, party Saturday. And then me and my son cooked a big dinner Yesterday, I cooked um, some stuffed shells, and he made steaks. So, we had a big dinner yesterday. So, my weekend was packed. But yesterday morning, when, when me and my husband got up, we got out there and started on the yard. So, we worked in the yard all day long until about 6 o'clock, I guess. And then came in, got a shower, and started on supper. So, but the yard sure does look nice, and I sure am proud that we got out there and did it. We had so many toys in the backyard. We went through those and got rid of a lot. Of course, can't do that with Abby back there because I don't care if it looks like it's been run over by a truck. She don't want to get rid of it. She's going to be a little pack rat. So, that's what i done this weekend. So, now this week... Since the kids are gone back to school and um, I'll have more time on my hands, I'll get all of my stuff together and get it in the mail. So, well, get the names picked and all that stuff and get the boxes in the mail. So, okay, I got this. It says that it's a rice steamer. I'll let y'all know how this works because I have no idea thing about it is they never send instructions you know like what do you do because it's this bucket and spoon comes in it and it's got this little thing that goes inside there like that and then it's got the lid and the lid's got two holes on the top of it well, they don't go like that. It goes like the other way. Okay. goes like that. And then it's got two snap deals on each side. So, then what? Then what? I don't know if... That's the only thing is it doesn't have any instructions. I was going to look... Maybe on the bag. No, nothing. So I'll have to figure it out. Maybe I'll have to look back on the um, deal on the phone and see if I can figure this out. And guys, I didn't write down none of the prices, but y'all are probably used to me doing that. I'm the worst at the worst of doing it. So I got this juicer the other day my son needed a bunch of limes juiced for whatever he was in there in the kitchen doing he did a Mexican dish she loves to cook so and I like him to the only thing about it when he cooks I mean I'm telling you from one end of the kitchen to the other is a mess I can't I can't hardly cook in there with him because I clean as I go and I can't I just can't. 
so okay this is what this is it gives you the on this side it's got the measurements and that's how the top looks and let's see what's inside here here is this course no instructions so is that see this is why I need a table and that goes on there like that and then this thing goes on here and then you twist it how does that work I guess you you push the orange down and then you push the orange down on it you twist it like this and then it makes the juice we'll have to get a piece of an orange or something all I have is right now I have apples strawberries and I have those little little oranges those um, oh heck I couldn't think of the name of them you know what I'm talking about those little oranges so this is the juicer now, I'm gonna have to figure out all this stuff so maybe we need to do another video where we're in the kitchen with this stuff trying to figure it out I had to laugh and um, I got a, a a message and it said that um, that my videos are very redundant and that I need to step my game up that um, <laughs> I need to step up my game because my videos are very redundant what I was told so I need to step up my game I need to find something to step it up so y'all remember that y'all tell me what I can do to step it up so and thank you for bringing that to my attention that maybe I need to find something else to do but um, this is my next box now these little th this little thing right here they're kind of expensive I think I paid like seven dollars for it I kept looking for the cheapest one and this actually right here this butter dish I ordered two of them it's this really nice glass butter dish and it comes with the little knife spreader with the porcelain handle I ordered um, the white and I ordered a black one so the white one this one here will be going in one of my giveaway boxes so in each giveaway box there will be kind of a nicer item like all the items are going to be nice but you know what I mean a little bit more expensive of an item one is the salt shake, salt and pepper shakers the like turquoise color one of them will be the uh, butter dish and I can't remember what else I got something else that's a little bit nicer that'll go into into um, one of the boxes so that's that guys some of the stuff that's that was in my hauls the girls took away from me um, there are several pair of these eyelashes and the girls took them they Mimi we have to have them school starts tomorrow you didn't do your hauls this weekend it's not our fault we have to have those lashes so they got their lashes and this is the only pair left that I have to show but it's not like y'all are thinking oh my gosh I'm turning the channel off she don't have the lashes forget it we ain't watching her so but they looked a lot like that though so and they kind of uh, took some of the fingernails so this is the one pair that they didn't take 
But those are really pretty, aren't they? I don't know how they wear these long fingernails like that. I think there was two more pair. There was some that was just like that. That was like a, a, a black and clear color. And then the other color was pink as well. Okay, I got some more of these strips that hold down the, um, hold your, um, oh heck, your carpet down, that holds down the carpet. And the ones that I got before that I hauled, um, with the big kitchen rug, they work. Now, they stick to the floor really well, but if I took the rug up, and had to wash it they're not reusable I mean you'll just have to put another one down and these are even better because this one's like that these are a lot better because the other ones were just the strips but this is actually going to work a whole lot better but they do work they will hold the rug down where it's not slipping and sliding but whenever you go to wash it you're going to have to put another deal on it so, as long as it works. Okay, I got another sign. I thought this one was really cute. It's got the little twine in the back where you can hang it. But, I haven't even got my other ones up yet. They're laying in there on the kitchen table. And I got some pel... <clears throat> excuse me. I got some pillow covers... And I'll take y'all in the living room and show you the pillow covers. I went ahead and put them on my pillows and they're on my couch in the living room. So, it's better that way anyway. Y'all can see what they actually look like on the pillow instead of me just holding them up and showing you. So, I wanted to go ahead and put those out. Okay, I got another pair of earrings. This is kind of a... A purple color. I don't. Oh, things off of it. The little, the little deal right here is off of this one. That's okay. It's easy fix. So this is what that one looks like. It's purple. I don't have any purple earrings, but I don't have any purple clothes. So I thought I'd buy them in case I ended up buying something purple. got another and this both of these are off here's the little hooks if you can see it see the little hooks both earrings does not have the hooks on them so that's all right they're easy to fix so here's the other the other color it's kind of a pinkish color. They're real light. Not very cute. And I ordered every color in them, I think. So, oh well. Here's another color that I got. This one here, I don't know if it's red or orange. And the, the hooks are not on these either. I, th I guess they said, the heck with that, they can figure it out. They're just not going to put the hooks on them. So there's another color that I got. I think those are orange. I put it up next to my fingernail and it looks orange. So, got that pair. Got another pair. I think these, let me see, are these? These are the exact ones that I have on. I ordered them twice. I thought that I did that. So, I opened them, but they're going to go away. Give, I'm going to give them in my giveaway box. They look exactly like these. So, I'll put this in my giveaway box because I ordered two of them. And they are pretty. They're real lightweight, not much to them. 
Okay, so I did it again on these. I'm going to open one of these. I think, I think I did. Let me put my glasses on. Yeah. No. I don't know. Let me open them. I think I ordered this. Yeah, I did. I ordered it twice. So, one of these will go into my giveaway. This is what this looks like. It's kind of the turquoise blue. It'll look good, kind of look good with what I have on today. So it's that, the Tree of Life, and the four bracelets. And here's the same one. This will go into my giveaway box. So I got that. Go in my giveaway. And I got another another one this is dark blue a dark blue color I like these bracelets you are thinking yeah we know you do you got enough bubble these are real pretty I got a butterfly on every one of them those are cute you can wear one by itself or you can wear all of them or two or you know Got a ring. Size nine. And this is a ring that looks like that. It kind of looks like these um, earrings. That's kind of pretty. different. Maybe I'll wear it today. Just leave it on. Okay. That's all the jewelry, guys. No, it's not. I got a necklace. And this is this. And the thing about this is, this, I think the necklace is so pretty. The beads on it are so pretty. But this does not match. Or that. Do y'all think? Or am I crazy? That just doesn't look like that goes together to me. It maybe it'd be all right. It's pretty. The beads are real pretty. But I just don't see how that matches. I don't remember it looking like that whenever I ordered it. I don't remember this looking like this. But, anywho, it's pretty. It's pretty. So, guys, what do I do to step up my game? Y'all know? Y'all give me any ideas or hints? Got another pair of earrings. And these are... Don't look anything like the picture, but they're pretty. And this is what these look like. I dropped it. So that's those. Alrighty. Okay, I got some of these. These, um, Vickies is what they are called. It's just like a, like a fashion accessory to go underneath your clothes. And that's what it looks like. It's just a collar. So, it looks really nice, like under sweaters, you know, um, 
it even looks cute underneath the sweatshirt if you want to dress it up. So, just a little white Dickies deal to just accessory that you'd put underneath the sweater. I'll show you what it, how cute they look whenever I try on these sweaters. I'll put one on. And then I got one in the bleaching color. I got all this stuff that I ordered and here it is a hundred degrees already I'm exaggerating but and I'm not going to be able to wear none of it because I get too hot all the buttons was undone I gotta button up one of the buttons or it won't, you won't even be able to tell what it looks like it is so hard to button buttons when you got fingernails on so this is what this one looks like it's just, it's just a bleaching one. But isn't it not, isn't it cute? I mean, it can really make your outfit step up a step. <laughs> I guess. So, that's those. Alright, I got these because I needed them. Um, I fry, whenever we do tacos, I fry the shell myself, the taco shell. So, I got these to flip the tortillas in the pan. Or to use whatever I need them to use for. I have some that I bought at the Dollar Tree. And they're um, plastic. And these are metal ones. So, I'm hoping that these will work better. Maybe. I don't know. They're not. They're pretty lightweight. Have to see. The other ones are plastic on the end and the piece keeps falling off. I did buy me another pair of them though. So, anyway, I got these to see if it'll hold up. My ne another order that... I ordered that's coming in. I ordered a bunch of like kitchen gadgets and stuff like that that I thought that maybe Samuel might want to use in the kitchen. Okay, I got this little box here because remember me telling y'all that I got some real pretty um, hand towels that I had bought, the ones with the roosters on them. So I'm not. I don't need that box. So I got this thing that I ordered. So I could hang it on the, um, I need to order me another one, but do you know this thing was $6? I can't believe I paid that for this, but the Dollar Tree does have something like this, and I bought some, but they're so extremely cheap that, um, it kept falling off my cabinet, and it looked terrible. This one does look a little bit better, and it's heavy, so hopefully this will work good. But anyway, I bought it to go on my cabinet right there by the sink where I can put my pretty towels on it. Because I don't like to put them on the stove because every time the stove door gets open, you find it in the floor. So, I said the heck with that. Here's another little juicer that I got. I actually, I put this in my, my bucket and in my cart. And I forgot to take it out because I found the other one and the other one's much nicer. And I had already put this one in there and they might work just the same. So this is just another little juicer to do a lemon or an orange or whatever. And that's what it looks like. So you just put your little fruit on there and twist it around. I wonder if you put this, put, put it on there and then put this because see how that is inside and then twist it. I don't know but that's what that looks like so that all that guys and this is my last thing that I have to show and I got this for Abby this is so cute this is a little food tray for her and it's got a lid the lid comes off See the lid comes off 
and then these little bows right here come out. And that's what it looks like. Because you can put some, you know, some oranges and some grapes and some cheese and then whatever her dinner is and dessert. Isn't that cute? And even a little heart. You can put stuff in a little heart. <laughs> she loved it. She's seen it, boy. She wanted to eat out of it right away. So this has actually been washed and, and used. If she sees something that's hers, she wants it right then. So, isn't that cute? So, that is my haul that I have. Um, I'm going to take y'all in there and let y'all see my uh, pillow covers uh, that I put on the couch. And um, I'll show you a couple of more things that I've got. Um, that I put out that I got that I hauled last week I can't get it out of my mouth what I was going to tell ask y'all earlier whenever I was saying do y'all have a routine that y'all just get up and y'all do that same routine every day I do like get up in the mornings get the kids off to school well get them up they're fussing around getting dressed putting the makeup on curling the hair Get them off to school. Drive them all over town. I get back home. Usually my first thing I do is go straight to the kitchen. I put whatever dishes is in the dishwasher. I um, pick up whatever needs to be picked up. Come in here and make my bed. Every day, the same thing. Turn the TV on. Usually material mom, Angela, she always has like a little talk show deal she does in the mornings I'll turn it on and I'll watch her and uh, so I have the same little routine that I do every day do y'all do that like I'm thinking there's got to be sometimes today's Monday I didn't do it today it's half price day at the thrift store I'm not saying I'm not going to because it's still early I might go there but there is absolutely nothing I need. I don't need anything. But I just keep buying, buying, buying. Why do we do that? And, you know, about her saying that my channel is, um, I'm redundant and I need to flip things around or change things. Only thing is, is I don't buy silly things. I don't um, have the money to buy silly things. If I buy stuff, it's stuff that I need or the kids needs or, you know, things that I think I can use. And um, I just don't buy silly stuff. But uh, I could change it up some other way, but I'm not going to buy a bunch of silly stuff that I'm not going to use. That's just a waste of my money, if, if you ask me. But that's my opinion. I don't think it matters much my opinion these days but um anyway let me go show y'all my pillow covers okay here's my pillow covers I'm kind of whispering because Abby is still asleep let me turn the light on in here um I know y'all are probably thinking you have the oldest grandma's looking couch ever I do I'm I, I guess I do. The kids tell me I do. But anyway, I got that one. Y'all think it matches my couch? You know, the kids, I tell, ask them stuff like that, and they're like, I don't know. So I got that one. I got two of those. And then I got that light, lighter pink. And then that one down there, it's um, in the back. It's got a strip back there. I don't know if y'all can see it or not. You take the strip off and it'll make the pillow fat. But if you put the strip in the middle, it makes it look like a bow. So, and then there's the other one that I got. And then there's my little Kleenex um, holder. And then I got this uh, other big pillow cover in the back there. And I got that pink blanket that it threw across and I already had that little thing there 
So I'll just walk y'all over here and show y'all what I uh, I put these candlestick holders on my fireplace. So and I I've probably showed that that before. I put those bird um, ones there, and then I put that little sign up there. And over here, I put the um, little reef deals that I got. And on the sconches on the wall. I might have already shown y'all that as well, too. So, and then I have this on the table that I put one around. Um, here is the mat that I got for the coffee area. So that's the little mat that I got. And I haven't, I haven't hung up any of my, um, any of my signs yet. I've got to get all my signs hung up. So that is what I've gotten lately. Okay, here's this little shirt that I got. I'm going to go ahead and show y'all that one. It's really, it goes down really long, but it's made small, I think. Either that or I'm just getting fatter and fatter. And that could be the case. So, this is what it looks like in the back. But, that's that one. Let me try on the rest. Okay, here's the orange one. See how cute they are? Like, they're so cute. That's what it looks like in the back. And see, if you take this little, I don't know if you'd want to wear this, this one with this or not, but no, that wouldn't look very good at all. So, but you could do the white one underneath it. You could put the white one underneath this. It would look really cute. Let me see if I can do it without actually, well, let me just slip it over my head. I'll just slip it over my head and see what it looks like. show you what I'm talking about. If I can get the button in the buttonhole. There it goes. I'm looking this mirror right here. It's got like arm holes where it'll stay down. You put your arms in it, you know, in the elastic part that's hanging out my neck right now. I don't have it on right, but let me pull it out my neck. That's not on right, but it kind of just gives you the deal of it. See, don't that look cute? Just dressed it up a little bit. And of course it looked a lot better because it's not on me right. But yeah. I think it does. I think it made it. What do y'all think? They are cute. Oh, excuse me. I hate it up. Um, they are really cute sweaters. Here's this one. One with the bear on it. The three colors. That's the back. Don't y'all think these sweaters are so cute? And so many other people live in much cooler, you know, climate than, than I live. They could wear these probably all year round so I told my husband I said can we move to um, oh heck I can't remember where it is uh, where material mom Angela lives I can't remember where she lives y'all y'all have to tell me but anyway it's cold there all the time he's like really 
you would want to live in that kind of a, and I said, yes, I would love it. You know, just be cool all the time, which I'm cold natured and I would probably really not like it, but I hate the heat. And I was born and raised right here in Texas and I'll probably never go anywhere else. You know, I was thinking, um, I was, today I was thinking, um, I was watching, uh, known as here in Grumpy Grandpa doing their uh, Monday mask and she was talking about um, going places. Do you know that me and my husband has been married for 10 years and we have only gone on vacation one time and that was right after we got married. My sister and her husband were going to Las Vegas and we went to Las Vegas with them. And it was the worst vacation ever. I don't like to gamble at all. And that's really all you really do. It was so hot there. I mean, it was steaming hot. So, you know, the tour buses, they don't have air conditioner on or anything. And my sister got the stomach flu. And she had this stomach bug, you know, that three-day terrible stomach bug where all you're doing is just in the bathroom. So she wasn't about to get on a hot bus. So we didn't do any shows. We didn't do anything except for just stay in that um, hotel. And they gambled. Oh, it, I was so glad to be home, so glad to be home. So, I told my husband, I said, I don't even care if it's just going to San Antonio to go down the river walk with the kids this summer, or I'd really like to do it before the heat of the summer because it gets so hot down there, but, you know, even if we just do that and maybe go to SeaWorld or something, just some kind of little vacation. Or what I would really like to do is like go to Port Aransas or Padre or something like that and rent one of those, um, uh, you know, those beach houses that they rent out for like, you know, the weekend or whatever. That would be nice because that's the only way that we would be able to really afford it is to go somewhere like that where you have a kitchen and all that where we could prepare our food and not have to eat out and all that, but then still go to the beach and have fun. The only thing is, is the beaches are so, the water is so, ugh, it's just, I'm scared to go in water that I can't see in. Does that make any sense? Like, I can't stand to go in lake water because I'm scared. I'm scared what's underneath there. We went to, um, I know I'm talking way too much, the most wonderful vacation that I have ever been on was all of my mom's kids went to um, Cozumel. We went to Cozumel, there was 11 of us, and we had the best time. We stayed there for... I think four, four days and three nights or something like that. But we had the best time. We had a blast. It was so much fun. It was so beautiful there. You get in the water and you were up here and you could just see your feet. It was a beautiful, oh, it was so beautiful. And we had the best time on that vacation. And that was just good memories. I loved it so much. But anyway, get back to my trying on. Okay, here's the black one with the horse. This one's really cute. It's a lot of flowers. You can put pretty much any color earring you want to put with this. My hair is so flat in the back. I fell asleep with my hair wet last night and it was sticking up all over my head this morning. So here's the black one.
Here's the one with the dragonfly. This one's a lot like the ones with the teacups. They almost look just alike, same coloring and everything. But this is cute, They're very soft. It's plenty long enough. It don't have much of a sleeve and I hate my arms. My arms are so fat and flabby. So that's this one. Here's this one. This is the one that um, I got on my sponsored. So this is what this one looks like. They're all so pretty and they feel good on. You know, I don't know what happened to that one that had the hole in it. Um, I went in there, everybody was saying maybe I had something sharp you know, in my washer and my dryer. Went in there, I had nothing sharp in there. Um, matter of fact, when I washed that uh, sweater, I had washed another sweater with it. So, I mean, it didn't have anything matter with it. It was just that one sweater. But I was gonna return it, and I had already returned something um, in that order and had already sent it back. So they wanted, so therefore I was going to have to pay like, I think, $7.99 or something like that. So my refund was only going to be $3 and something. That wasn't worth me going down there and having to worry about going down there and taking it and boxing it and blah, blah, blah. So I just, I'll use it for a dust rag. I'll use it for something because I couldn't repair it, not with it being right there in the middle of my chest. So, I just put it in some stuff that I cut up and use for, you know, cleaning around the house or whatever. I'll do something with it. But this is this one. Okay, and this is the last one. This one's real pretty, too. They're big and just, and this, they're all uh, extra larges. So if you got like a 2X in this, it'd be pretty big. They run big. So another thing that I didn't show y'all is I got Daisy a bed. Remember I told you she's not allowed on the bed anymore because she's, you know, been doing her deal on my bed. So no more. So anyway, I got her a new bed and she loves it. Let me show y'all. She's asleep. See her little bed? She loves it. She's in there asleep. Hi, Daisy. <laughs> I put her little blanket in there and she loves it. She loves that bed. It was only like $11 and that was the extra large one. So. She's just snug as a bug in a rug. Okay, guys. That's my haul for today. I hope y'all enjoyed it. Um, y'all just let me know what I can do, and I'll try to do it. And um, I looked on my deal, and I got a lot of orders out, but I didn't see any that's going to be delivered today. So maybe this week I'll have another one uh, come in. So I might just have to get on here and talk. I might just have to get on here and just talk because I don't have anything else to show y'all. Um, unless I go to the thrift store today, I might go to the thrift store and see what I can find there. We went into the Dollar Tree over the um, weekend. The girls wanted to go in there and pick up some stuff and um, they didn't really have anything new in. I keep thinking maybe they might get a few more Easter things on their uh, 5 and $3 aisle, the plus stuff, but they haven't, so it's so close to Easter now they might not, but I do need to go by there and pick up some more candy for Abby's basket. I got her a lot of stuff to go in her basket, but I don't really have any candy, and she don't need a lot of candy anyway. That's another I got in one of my subs one of these somebody that subscribed to me got on to me for buying her too much candy so yeah I got in trouble for that but um, 
so I am going to pick her up some more, few things, candy, and put in there, and, and maybe the girls a few more um, things for their basket as well. I know they're grown, but I still get them a Valentine's, I still get them an Easter basket, so there's nothing wrong with that. They still live here, and they're still all my babies, but... Um, Maybe tomorrow, um, I've been wanting and people have been asking me about um, how I got the kids and what, how did that come about and I've been um, going to share that with y'all. So maybe this week will be a good time to share that because I don't really have anything else to show y'all. So saying that. I appreciate each and every one of y'all, and um, if y'all haven't ordered from Timu, what's wrong? Go ahead and get on there and order something. It's not a big deal. I know there's uh, this big deal going on. Some of the news stations and some of the other haulers have gotten on the news, and you know, but um, I don't know. I don't know, guys. But anyway, I love and I appreciate y'all. And um, if you hit that like button and give me a thumbs up, I would so appreciate it. And for y'all that have my new subscribers, thank you for subscribing to my channel. I appreciate it and um, I'm so grateful. And for y'all that's been there with me a long time, I love y'all. And um, I'll talk to y'all soon. Until then, bye for now.